this hybrid baby monkey is made of cells from two embryos. Green eyes, fingernails on the fingers. Now, the other embryo was from a distant donor embryo, and the resulting animal in the first live-born chimeric primate to have a high proportion of cells originated from the donor stem cells. This opens the door using chimeric monkeys, which are more biologically similar to humans than rats or mice. These embryos were implanted into 40 surrogate females. Only 12 surrogates became pregnant, but only one gave birth to a live chimeric monkey. Was a male, but later had to be euthanized. This is including the brain, lungs, and heart, and were descendants of the donor stem cells. The highest level of chimerism was seen in the adrenal gland. The progenitory donor stem cells made up of 92% of the cell. It wasn't a perfect match, so that's why developed a state of recipient embryo. This layman term was very sick. They say this method is to use to grow human organs in pigs or non-human primate tissues to help humankind, hum humanity. But he did live 10 days before being euthanized. The other embryo was a Chinamoglius monkey. There is one creator, one creator only, and that has Heavenly Father above. You will never be able to sustain, replicate, or make a human. We are human. You can make your robots with your fake skin. You can even make your lizard people. But you will not in any way, shape, or form ever to be able to replicate what God himself made. Keep trying and see what the Heavenly Father does. Country crazy out. Yeah, one more thing. That monkey had green eyes. Had fingernails. Finger nails. And I sure wish I could find this story. I'm searching like hell and high water. But I saw where a woman in another country had gotten impregnated with embryos of this nature. And she said she was doing it for humanity and humankind. I'm going to find that video and I'm going to share something nefarious is going on.